Yo, Mr. Bulgari here. Hey. If he does want to sell, I want to buy. How much oh. would you offer the last time? Double it. Offer 20 million, and then we see if it is not for sale. If this painting is not hanging on my wall, your hat will be. Okay? Think about that. You want I should pay visit to his children at their school? Not yet. I think there's always a price in this city. Oh, Louis, excuse us. We have been rude. Don't worry about it, man. I like the setup here. These guitars are all collector's items. Celebrity rock memorabilia. Okay, man, good for you. Got a nice place here, Mr. B. That is piece of shit. I bought it for my sister. Hey, you bring me to this fucking country and you keep me in an ugly cage. No one on TV lives in fucking Dukes. Then you come and move all my stuff into hallway and fill place with fucking guitars. Shut up, bitch! Take your pills! A friend of mine is here! Ha! You don't have any friends. You don't even have a business here. You are nothing in this My country. sister. She's still getting adjusted. We all are. So how can I help you? Fuck you, Ray. You have ruined my life! Yes! Yes! <sighs> a difficult situation. It seems I'm being investigated by the National Office of Security Enforcement. There is a particular unit that has a hard on for me. And why? Because Mark Yashwili won't sell me the rampage. You'll get rid of them. I will own this fucking team. Hey, the problem ain't just gonna disappear over here if we kill some crooked cops. Leave that strategizing to me. If the money tells you to cut your fucking legs off, you'll do it. Because the money is better than a fucking leg. The money is making the plans. That's the American way. All right, man. Thank you. I like you. I make you rich. I make you man. Maybe I'll make you a man with one leg, but <laughs> I'll make you a rich man with one leg. There is this team tracing a cow mine. Take out the whole team. No exceptions. Okay, man, if that's what the money wants. You're a bright guy, Luis. I still like you. You made a good choice coming here. Fag man, no good. Go! Roll the bitch! Ting, 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 ting! <laughs> Go to the garage of Torpa Street. Here are some makeshift bombs. They will be useful. The news broke? I'll need more than bombs. Give me that machine gun you got here, and I might just be ready. It's good to have you with us, Louis. Yeah? Yes. It must be nice for you to get out from the under big Tony. I don't know what you're implying, bro. Tony and me are partners. I got a stake in the Enterprise. <laughs> a stake? Sure. You still take orders from him, don't you? You cut up your shit. Look, it could be much more than that. Unless you enjoy working for such a man, partner or whatever you call him. Really, bro? I don't know. When I was left to my own devices, I got locked up. At least with Tony's guidance, I ain't doing time. Perhaps, for now, perhaps. But do you think you're achieving everything you could? A man with your talents, in your condition, you could have anything you want. I didn't get to where I am without being able to see the world of man. That's real flattering, Mr. Bulgari. But whatever it is you're offering, I'm gonna have to decline. Me and Tony's is a business relationship. He gets his kicks elsewhere, but he's been a good boss to me, and a good guy. Help me out. I'm not a fucking faggot! Whatever you say, bro. Thank but what are you talking you about? Stay. I was saying that I may be interested in investing Thanks. in Fly your safely. potential. Potential as what? As a businessman, I am looking for someone here in Liberty City with the correct relationship. 
I already got one employer. Like I said, he's been good to me. Of course, but what is he? He is a drug addict, a madman. You are useful to him, but you think that is all he wants from you. <laughs> when some new muscle-bound pretty boy comes along, he will forget about you and your precious stake in the Tony Prince Empire. Whatever, bro. Can we talk about something else? What am I doing here? You are helping me with my business. This don't seem like legitimate business to me, man. Nothing can be achieved here in Liberty City with actual pigs rooting through my affairs. For anything to happen, they must be eliminated. Okay, man. You really can't buy these people off? Sometimes a price is more effective if paid out of lead, not gold. This is the first lesson I will give you. Okay. Hey, man. What's up? What do you mean, what's up? Where are you? Look, man, I, I'm taking care of some personal business. I'll come see you later, okay? I'm cracking up here, Luis. Hurry the fuck up. How long are you gonna be? I don't know, man. I, I, I gotta go. Your master calls? Yeah, man. I see. And does he know that you are here with us? No. Interesting. I guess so. Let's go in. Fabrica over there. Make sure a bomb is well hidden. We shall be concealed here. Well done. That will be a fun treat for them. These guys are all crooked, huh? Marty has this in his pockets. This news team is in charge of half the drugs running in the city. Do not let your conscience worry you. Dimmer, bro. You ain't talking much. You nervous? Fuck you. This is bad, Wayne boy. That's the car. Get in and plant the evidence. When they got around the car, blow it. Close it, people!
mask attack us all. I still have smell of meat in nose. Bro, it's true. You are one who blew them up. That you did lose a serviceable job. Most competent. How'd I get myself into this shit, man? You didn't get yourself into this? I choose you. I'll pick you out because I see potential in you. You're lucky to be here. Yeah, great, thanks. But if you need more cops taken out, crooked or otherwise, you ain't choosing me. Look at this. The sensitive, modern American man. You need to go home and exfoliate your bolts. May as well cut them off. What the fuck is this? I don't like killing government agents, so I ain't got no balls? Give me a break. Okay, calm down. We got no more law enforcement to expand. For now. Those were the only guys smack ahead of us. You think he will sell? He has no choice but to sell. We have taken away his protection. It's that simple, is it? It should be. Maki is a weakling. He lives here in exile, like all cowards. But he has been here for a long time, so he has more connections that others of us have not been able to acquire. This little creep should have severed a good deal of those connections and will give others involved a pause before they continue their association. Okay. Perhaps I will buy clubs of you as well. You sell them to me? Them clubs is levers to the max already, man. I don't know if there's anything left to sell. I don't care about other investors. They will forget about debts if I am involved. Some of these investors aren't the type to go away. They aren't the type to pay off either. Anyway, it's not my place to sell them. I have a stake, but Tony's got the controlling share. Ha <laughs> ha! Of course! Tony pulls the string and the little puppet man bends for him. Let me know when Tony next has hand up your ass and when Triloquins dummy can talk. Fuck, man! What's wrong with you? Your stake is bullshit. You think you run the club? But you are still just security. You are Tony's gim, and you won't admit it. It's not like that. This what you want to do your whole life? No, but seriously, bro. I have opportunities for you. Think about them. Think about what I said to you. The offer will not be there forever. Okay, I will. Send my regards to Big Tony. Luis! Yeah? It's me, Arnold. Thank fucking God I can see you. Thank you, God. Maybe you do exist. Uh, Arnold, what are you uh, doing down here, bro? Uh, well, we had a little incident. I don't mind when the girl play rough, but when the pimp come in and he plays rough too... Oh, la, 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 la. What happened, bro? I tell you, it is a bad combination. Chinese opium and Brazilian prostitutes? No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, no doubt, man. I was just nodding off after a little bit of light after dinner bondage, and when the pimp comes in, he steals my wallet and gives me a good beating. <laughs> For watching too much television? <laughs> somehow, uh, somehow I feel my dignity is still intact. Wait a second. You're a guy who just enjoyed an opium-laden threesome with some light bondage. How could your dignity ever be in question? <laughs> exactly, <laughs> my friend. Uh, well, maybe you can help me uh, get back the wallet. Hey, compared to the shit I dealt with today, okay, that doesn't sound so shady. <laughs> <laughs> so why the fuck you not? <laughs> I believe he is over on Bronco, my valiant Spaniard. Sorry, bro, but you're getting jacked. This is mine, man. I just, uh, forgot the keys. Fighting in the street? Why did he not just ask me for the money? If he needed it, we could have made an arrangement. Perhaps a little four-way. 
Maybe he didn't want to subject himself to no bondage, light or otherwise. He was perhaps more dumb than sub, that's true, but surely being a pimp implies some perversity, or at least curiosity. It would have been an experience. Yo, don't worry, bro. We're gonna subject him to some shit soon enough. Life is an unpredictable thing, my friend. You don't need to tell me. Here's an example for you to digest. This morning, a delicious 22-year-old girl left her parents' apartment in Middle Park East. The only thing on her mind was buying a coffee. But uh, I made her a proposal. Soon she was drenched in champagne, bent over naked in my hotel suite. <laughs> Before 11 a.m., she was shoveling cocaine into her nose with a caviar spoon and begging me to give it to her again. And a few hours later, you was getting your ass beat by a pimp in Bohan. Life sure does twist and turn. Touche. I should introduce you to my boss, bro. You guys could party together. Ah, uh, perhaps on my next trip. Yeah, no doubt. If we survive that long, you're on. That's him. Do you think you can get my wallet back? Don't worry, bro. He ain't getting away with your wallet. The pervert's back? I ain't letting you nowhere near me, you fucking French freak. See you end up one of them deviant sex stories gone wrong. Like one of them guys who strangled themselves trying to get off. Civilian like you coming out to the point is almost a suicidal. This is where I'm leaving you. You still might get robbed around here, but they won't kill you. Adieu, dear boy. It's been fun. Drink? Oh, something stronger. Huh? I'm cool, bro. You know how to play the drums? We need a fucking drummer. I ain't your man, bro. Sorry. You Spanish have the rhythm. Give us a fucking beat, man. You don't drum, but you dance, don't you, Luis? You dance. I can dance, man, but not with you and him. That's a shame. You dance, Mr. B? Money. Doesn't dance the money. Doesn't dance, my friend. Okay, but you need some work done. Oh. Oh. Wait, wait. Listen. Ooh. Ah, this is it. This is it. Ooh. Hey, can you ask the ape to stop playing for a second? You want I should stick $50,000 guitar up your ass? No, but I got some friends I can introduce you to if that's how you get your kicks. Oh, funny guy. All right. All right, okay. You have heard about Liberty City Rampage. The owner still will not accept my offers. I have been more than reasonable. You mean after you killed this special team of cops? It's weird. You want me to negotiate with him? 
No. The time for negotiations over. Do what needs to be done in his boardroom. Send a message. Hey, I ain't a hitman, bro. I mean, I'll fight anyone, do whatever. But I ain't a contract killer. The offices are in the me TV buildings. Yet yeah, it will not be easy. You'll have to find someone else, man. I mean, it's not my thing. I ain't qualified for that shit. I am sorry. I wasn't discussing your career development. I was telling you what to do. No! Fuck off and go! Поехали! Wait for me! We go to Eleport in Fish Market South. I'm sorry to break up your party, man. You look like you were having fun. Mr. Ray wanted me to keep watch on you. Make sure you do a pull. Hey, I don't need no watcher. Mr. Ray think you do. Shit. You think I want to be here? Whatever. Okay. So? So fucking what? So, what's up, bro? Fuck off. Chill, man. I'm just trying to converse with you. My job is hospitality Your and... job is kill Marky Ashley for Ray Bulgarin. Dimmer, bro. I like to think I can talk to people. I try to put them at ease. Make them open up. Sure. They open up when you shoot in their head. You put people in the ground, my friend. You kill her like me. That's what Bulgarin want you to do. So that's what you do. Hospitality is for weaklings. You're hard work, bro. Fuck you! You are hard work. Don't even know what you are. Hey, I know who I am. Sure, I do bad shit, but that ain't who I'm gonna be forever. <laughs> I've heard this before. Fuck off. You want me to shut up? Good. Good. Great. Total fucking silence from here on in. Fucking terrible conversationalist, thing. You know, can see. My lips are sealed. Getting a peep out of me. Here is Chopper. Drive. Hot dog, hot dog. We go above Star Junction. High as you can go. I'm gonna swing out over the Brogo Bridge. We'll gain some height and come back over the city. Here, I have headset for you. This is so we communicate when you're in building. Just what I always wanted. A hotline to a fucking charmer. Can you tell me what the plan is? Ashley office is in Meet TV building. You no going to get in from ground, so you come in from above. Out the chopper? Great. He's not so tough. I would do, but there is chance Ashville's people come for my family back in old place. And you ain't worried about my family? No. Tell me why we can't just land on the building. You think they would not notice chopper landing on building? You must go in silent. Perk, when you get in building, I will give instructions through headset. You kill Ashfilly, send message and leave building. I pick you up on ground. 
Sounds real tough for you, tough guy. We nearly here. When you go, I will take controls. I think I see someone on roof. Look into it. This shit die now! We have him now! I'm gonna shoot this bitch in the balls! I'm in. Yo, feel Fuck you! Ashley no more around. Yeah, great. Tell him I'm not his fucking hitman, okay? That's not why I'm hanging with him. I am sorry, Mr. Hospitality Man. You do what Mr. Ray says. That's it. I see you soon. Stick your guitar up your fucking ass. <laughs> 